hi guys welcome back to another video today i'm going to be testing i don't know why i said testing this isn't a makeup video um i'm going to be trying on i basically bought from the black friday sale when i purchased the products they were had up to 99 percent. i didn't get any products that were 99 percent off like i don't know how y'all find those but me i did not but I basically found some products and then I also got an additional 25% off. So obviously some of these won't be the same price as I have purchased them for. But a lot of them aren't like super expensive because, you know, we got to save our coins. You know what I'm saying? I've got a huge bag. So yeah, I got a load of products. It's a huge bag. And basically all the products I picked up, I'm going to call them basically basics, essentials. Because I've just come to the conclusion, you've got to stop buying stuff that like, oh, just this, like, it's cool to buy the trend and stuff, but you have to also buy your stable pieces because that's how you can layer up things. So, yeah. Also, you can layer them, you can reuse them, and they just never go out of fashion. And it's like, when you buy too many things, I tend that I've done that in the past. And I'm like, oh, I can't wear this now, or I don't like this with this, it just doesn't go anymore. It's because... I bought too many things that were trending. We're not doing that no more. Tops. So this is one of, I'm actually wearing um, one of the tops because I literally couldn't find anything to wear. Um, and I'm actually wearing the joggers now, which I will just show you. These are the joggers I'm wearing. This is like really the weirdest way of showing it. But I'm like, maybe I'll show a clip of me standing back over here further away. I just want to show you quickly kind of get the idea of what i'm doing i want to show you guys what i'm talking about so these are the joggers and those are the ends so they do like come in if that makes sense like you can see and they have the adjustable band and i think the color of these is just so cute it's not your like typical gray it's like a bluey gray i guess you could say like a dusty gray i don't know Kind of reminds me of dusty blue, but it's not dusty blue, it's a, it's a grey, but it's so pretty, like, it's gorgeous. And on the inside, on the inside, they've got like that thick, soft material, I absolutely adore. Also, size-wise, as like a guide, I bought everything in, I think it was either small or medium, so I'm actually a size now, it used to be a size 6, 8, but now... I like a 10 to 12, so I've gained weight. Mm -hmm. Your girl has gained weight. But regardless, um, I'm going to say how these things fit because it's like a weird one. When you gain weight, it's like, what fits you, what doesn't? I, I just never know. Like, you'll try something on and it'll fit you, and then other things, it just won't. So, here we go. Let's get into the video. <laughs> Since I'm already wearing one of the products, I got this tea. I actually got to stay on it, so, you know, like, not any fluff on me. I feel like we're all obsessed with the whole Skims. I would love to be able to buy some Skims products, but... <laughs> the bank account, not right now. Maybe for Christmas. It looks like it doesn't look see-through there. It's literally not see-through. Um... But it is figure hugging. I find sometimes when you buy these like long fitted t-shirts, they're like still loose and baggy. Okay, so I bought a few fitted t-shirts because like I said, we need stable pieces. Like only things we can layer with. My mom's literally always said to me that that's what you should do. Like, like buy things that you can see yourself wearing in like, I don't care if this sounds extra, but in five years. Because I know loads of us have stuff in our cupboard that we do not touch. And it's a waste of money. I already have one of their slinky sort of, which do remind me a little bit more of Skims. This is more of a cotton, but I still feel like it's still given. I picked up two more of these type of tops in a grey and in white. Just so you know what it's called, it's a basic white cotton blend long sleeve fitted t-shirt. And I got a size 10 in this. So yeah, this is a size 10 white t-shirt. I don't know if you can see, but it's like kind of like stretchy. Kind of see. It's such good quality. Like you just need this in your cupboard. And I feel like the length is perfect. And sometimes I get tired of bodysuits. Like you don't always want to wear bodysuits. You just want a plain fitted tee. In the grey, so in the grey one, the material's more cotton. I don't know how to describe the other one, but it felt more like a like 
it has like a different texture or feeling to it where this does feel like cotton like it does feel like normal basic cotton um but i had a feeling i had a feeling that the gray one was going to be a different texture just because it's that type of print but just another basic for your wardrobe so i picked up some t-shirts fitted t-shirts as well however just so you know these two were in the same section and then the grey one was in a separate section. I thought it'd be kind of cute with maybe these, like grey on grey sort of look. The grey one is called the Charcoal Basic Cotton Short Sleeve T-shirt in a size 10. But look how cute this is. I can't wait to try this on. This is so nice. The material feels... It's like soft cotton. It's like... I don't know if you guys can see like you girls that love to wear like cargos i really love the idea of wearing these some cargos some trainers like super simple and i feel like with this you can layer this as well you can wear a hoodie on top of this or um a zipped hoodie like super cute and the color is to die for again another basic tee material can you see what i'm saying by the material it's like so nice i love it and it's a pure black it's not like an gray black or a like it's been washed too many times black like you know when your jeans fade it's not like that but this is the material and i will say as well with these type of things make sure you wash them properly so that way you take care and they stay the same texture but super cute not sure if any of you guys are going to skip past this one because it's another like the other three i've just shown you it's a white t-shirt instead now but i'm really curious to see how this fits it's just so stretchy it's got like an elastic -y sort of feel to it but also cotton this is just super sweet i love it basic white fitted t-shirt so i picked up a jumper i actually picked up two jumpers you know the drill oh no three it was three ash gray oversized sweatshirt so it feels quite big actually the material feels super nice super soft and it feels really warm and it's got that it's got that fleece material i don't know if you guys can really see but this feels super nice and i feel like the way it fits is like loose this Imagine one of those t-shirts underneath this and some joggers or even jeans. Super cute. 10 out of 10. This is the white t-shirt. Super bright. Super thick. Again, this is so thick. This is so nice. Who doesn't need, who doesn't need a white jumper in their closet? A white oversized jumper. I wish I'd picked up some cargos. I feel like this would have been super cute. But super thick material, like the grey one. Um, it has that fleece material. I picked this up in a medium as well. Um, obviously, if you don't like how baggy it is or loose, you can always size down. I feel like this fits really nicely on me. Can I just say to anyone that is, I don't know, does the distribution or who does this sort of stuff for PLT, I love when you guys actually write on here, not just on the tag, because it's like, Obviously, the intention isn't to return, but if you are, you can always put it back in there. And some of us, I actually keep some of my new stuff still in their bags just because I'm like, I don't want to get stains on it or it ruined and I just know it's new. So, thanks, guys. This is the hoodie. These are quite big. They are elastic as you can see. But, I mean, still cute. I love that, like I said, like before, it's a pure can you see it? I don't know what my lighting's playing out, but it is a black. Um, Renew PLT. Cute. Nothing too much. I don't really like slogans, anything like that. I just like, this is all basics. It also has this rouge in here. Sized. It has the pockets, you know, <laughs> when you're socially awkward out in person and you just want to, and just... And just text on your phone that made no sense but that's what i do when i get nervous i'm like ah, i need somewhere to put my hands i need a bag i just need something to hold is that normal i don't know but this is the jumper i liked it um bit oversized but i feel like it's given boyfriend hoodie like my boyfriend gave this to me but he didn't because i bought it myself so 
yeah so i picked up some blazers and actually i picked up a coat as well i forgot i did that but i did that so i'm excited blazer one is this one it's supposed to be a light gray but i like i know you can see it's light gray here but i feel like in person it is light gray but it looks more like a nude to me like it looks more nude so i'm gonna try and insert like a photo here that i've taken with it more true to light so you guys can see um it's super nice it's a linen um coat which i mean sometimes these can be a little bit more difficult when it comes you definitely need to iron these to make sure that they stay in shape um you can feel the shoulder pads one thing i really like about this is the like buttons match be like most blazers i pick up in a size 10 i like fit or like they're loose still but i feel like because of the material of this it's more figure hugging as you guys can see in the video so if you wanted this more oversized i feel like this does suit being figure hugging i think if you want this looser you will need to size up this is the green i love the like silk material inside it is like that typical um i guess blazer material you could say these were the buttons just so you can get a look like i literally love the color of this i feel like this is a stable piece color it does have shoulder pads and i'm such a mixed emotion pass match shoulder pads like and because it's quite like a thinner material i i like the way it fits but i also at the same time i'm a little bit maybe i guess you could say insecure like i'm a bit like what if it looks too padded i don't know um i don't know so just to be warned um so you know but I do think it's still really nice and the colour of it, I think you could wear this with so many different things. And I think it's a very mature, if you're going for lunch, brunch, maybe dinner, you're going to work. I just think this is so versatile. This has shoulder pads as well, but this one is, feels a lot thicker. The material is a little bit different to the other one. Definitely think it's a lot thicker. Um feels a bit more expensive than the green blazer. Love the colour of this. The buttons are like these, so seamless, you know, we love. I just thought I'd try it on again to show you guys. Like, I don't care about the long arms because, like, you can roll those up and have, like, a look like that. Show for jewellery. The shoulders were just a bit broad for me. I don't know. Like, I still feel like I might keep this, though, just because I think when I look at myself proportioned here, obviously in the video you can see, but proportioned i think it looks nice it's given um i'm a businesswoman what do you guys think you guys like and just to show you this is the french coat i got this from the petite section because i didn't want the trench coat to be super long um so because i'm 5'4 five, 5'4 four. Five, four or 5'5 five, five. i think i'm 5'4 um last time i checked i was <laughs> It's given raincoat. The color is gorgeous. I don't want to say rich, but it's given rich, rich B energy. <laughs> um, but no, um, I love the buttons. I feel like they're super nice. Um, obviously, you guys know I picked up some boots, and I feel like this is like such a cute. It's just the look. I'm so excited. These are the boots I ordered from PLT. I absolutely love these. These are super cute, 10 out of 10. Super cute for winter. I wish I'd got a shot with me actually wearing them, but I would definitely recommend. It's really lightweight. It's not heavy. Um, I really like that about it. The material feels really nice. I feel like this fits me quite tight, okay. snug. <laughs> but I have gained weight and I do need to lose weight. So I reckon once I've lost some weight, this will fit just perfectly because right now i feel like it's i can only wear like a top underneath it i don't think i can wear a jumper as of yet but the length is perfect super gas if you're around my height or if you're you're obviously shorter than me you might find this still a bit long but trench coats are supposed to be long and i defo love this so i picked up this and these and i'm just gonna explain something before we even get into showing you what they look I picked up these leggings because I did previously pick them up in, and I got it in the tour section, like, what was I thinking? Um, and I picked these up with the intention of doing it as a set and also wear the bottoms individually. No! 
so these are the top and leggings i will insert a photo here as well so you can see that it is how it looks in person because it's glittery can you see the glitter it's glittery i didn't know it was glittery i didn't i don't know if i was just blind when i was looking at it but um i did not know that mine but this was from the petite section it looks quite cropped um you guys will just see what it looks like i mean it's not see-through but you can kind of see my knuckles a little bit i mean so you're gonna need to wear a thong with this one you know what i'm saying i just think this is super cute if i was like slimmer i feel like this would look this is just such a cute little set i think some clear heels this would just be a look just like and a cute little bag there you go if you wanted if you didn't feel as confident you could just pop a blazer with this like the new blazer i've got so i would recommend about this product is the material here is a bit scratchy on the outside but on the inside it doesn't feel scratchy so that was dope these also say that the color may run so just so y'all know you heard it here first i'm joking now they they've got like a decent size band um this is i got these in a size what size did i get these in i got these in a small now you must be thinking why did i get them in a small like i'm not a small the reason i picked them up in a small was because i got a medium last time and i found they were stretching way too much they have like a nice soft material on the inside i don't know if you guys can see which is different defo recommend if you like them to be a not looser because they are leggings at the end of the day but not super tight, then um, size up to a medium. I think these are really good and lengthwise as well. I can so see wearing like some socks, some trainers and a hoodie and I'm ready to go with a, a little gilet. I was expecting more like a, it's like a chestnut. I was expecting more like a mocha brown. I don't know, but it's still cute and I can still see myself wearing it. It's like a ready brown instead of like a chocolate brown. Um, which I personally prefer chocolate. This I think would look really nice on even fairer skin tone as well. Um, and darker skin tone because it's not like a true brown. It's more like a red brown. But I know sometimes with a red brown it can kind of clash with skin complexion. It's not always the best. Um, but yeah, that's just my honest opinion. And I recently had a haul. Um, I'm just going to show you. <sighs> Where I picked up this, it literally still has the tag on it. Um, it was a sage green single breast and shoulder padded blazer. I love it. It's gorgeous. Fits super nice. I might include a clip. Um, you'll probably see it on my Instagram or somewhere on my social media. But I love this. Till green is in and I feel like we all need this. And I feel like with blazers, you can dress them up. Lunchtime, evening, going out on a day. Um, casual. Um, wear a hoodie underneath it really super cute i can only find one of the pair of bottoms i've got and these are the petite boots or spit hem so you know the drill i love these bottoms um all my bottoms are from plt i actually have a dark pair dark pair dark pair of blue jeans like denim blue jeans like do you know where they are and i got that actually from not the petite section um and i got a size 10 or 12 i think i did i got these in a size 12 because they fit like a size 10 just so you know i don't know where the dark blue ones are like i'm confused conflicted but anyways as you guys know i love plt i like shopping there i find stuff that fits me um even when i was small and when i'm larger and um, there's nothing wrong with that so if you guys like this stuff i definitely recommend i definitely recommend nowadays just getting things that you can wear for different occasions not just for you know buying this for this outfit you need to find things that you can use for different occasions so i hope you guys love this video as much as i love trying on this stuff like subscribe comment and, and catch you guys in the next video.